Okay guys, we're out of the wind and we are back out shed hunting. Um, it's looking like a really cool piece of property. We were able to turkey hunt here, Brooks deer hunts here, and uh, I can see why he deer hunts here. There's a lot of tracks. We're out looking for some sheds today. Let's see if we can find another monster. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned. Sorry about the wind noise. It's pretty windy out. But let's have a day today. Let's go. Let's do something. Look at that. Look at that. Another, that's a pretty decent sized rub. Barely get my hand around. In this like super thick stuff. That's crazy, that's sweet. All right, we're on to something. Let's keep going down this path. Wow, it's a pretty solid path right there. I think we're onto something here. I think we are getting onto something. All right, it's not a race. Let's go, let's look, let's look this through. Let's not rush it. This is some pretty thick stuff. All right, super thick. One nice path here. I'm not gonna just look at the path. We'll look off both directions. Walking super slow. It's not a race. I just gotta tell myself that or else, or else I walk too fast, probably. We'll see ya. Just made it to this ditch. Checking around pretty hard up here. There was a whole bunch of rubs on trees back there and I've been kind of following the path that they've been taking. Just keeping my eyes peeled. All right, let's get it moving. There was a huge path coming out of that swamp that me and Brooks split up. Brooks went that way through this little thicket. I came around and I'm going to the cedars. Um, there's a big path that comes through this swamp, comes down right onto this like mowed trail. There's another mode trail that goes that way, but it kind of wise here. So I'm kind of thinking that some might go this way, some might go that way. I might just make a big loop and walk through these cedars. I gotta remind myself, just to slow down, slow down, look, look around. You'll find it, you'll find it, you just gotta look. You can't just run through a forest and expect to find them. Slow down and just look around couple steps every 30 seconds you know really scan that left side scan that right side high low so as we're looking kind of hit like a little wall in this break of like grass I'm just gonna kind of walk this and find the biggest trail down like the path that they'd easily go through oh there's a rub over here okay over here. Just scanning everywhere. A deer can run anywhere now. The snow, I mean, besides through trees, but I'd beg to differ about that. Anywhere though, they can run anywhere. Okay, so I first checked like the outside edges. Um, there's a few like cedar trees right out there. Just three of them sitting out, kind of in the open. Checked those, nothing. Came in here into these pine trees, these big ones. Uh, I don't know what these ones are called, but um, I'm gonna just kind of look around underneath all of these. They kind of have a trail going right back through here, so kind of just gonna kind of walk around super slow and just scan the ground. So I walked pretty much this half of the woods. Brooks walked this half of the woods. Nothing really. I think Brooks is over there looking at that little finger. 
Let's get up to him and see what he's got. So I just came from over here. Brooks just came out of this little woods. Any luck? No antlers, but we found another race tire. It's probably garbage. The compact 600 Bushnell. Wow. That's not bad. Oh, yeah. She's been used and abused. I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> All right, let's get walking. We parked up there. Yeah, fire skipper's on us. All right, up the hill we go. It's windy. What is it, blowing like 25? It's, it's ripping. All right, see you up the trucks. Tough little slope here to walk up. Might be gas by the time we get to the top, but. Can you take that side and I'll walk this side again, or should we both walk that side, or? What do we got? No way. <laughs> oh my. Holy smokes. Yeah, no kidding. Wow. Have you ever seen that deer before? No, I haven't. Never seen that one. Wow. Oh, look at that. I think I have that one that I found uh, the other day in my truck. We'll compare sizes. Holy smokes, nice find. Where was it, just right back in here? Right in this little thicket. I guess, yeah, if the wind's blowing at him, he can see a lot and just lay down right here. Came walking through here. I don't know, that's sweet. That's a hell of a find. You don't find that every day. And, and, and we wouldn't have saw it walking down because we literally walked down on this side and it would have been tucked. Yeah, so like, look at that. Look at that, you can't even see that. And I'm like 10 feet away from it. Wow. Wow. All right. Let's keep walking up this tree line. We'll see if there's something else. Maybe this is a match. One last little check down by this little pond. There's a pretty nice trail going right up here. Around this pond though. Hmm, looks solid. I'm gonna keep walking it. I wonder if that is because of the Yeah, but that's the one Brooks just found. Yeah, the dude's going Brock found. The sizes, even on yeah, the bases. Yeah. Wow, that's that's got to be a really old deer. Yeah, it's got all this like other just weird junk. Stuff. Yeah, whatever it is. And this one's really clean compared to it. Yeah, no kidding. Wow, that's insane. And that's a big deer. Yeah. Like this one's huge. Yeah. Yeah. Look at it. It's... <laughs> way taller, way thicker. Wow. Yeah, that's crazy. Okay, just made it back to the truck. Sweating like crazy. It's pretty warm. It's windier than all it can be, but it's pretty warm out. Um, Brooks found a giant. Uh, yeah, that was pretty cool, but we walked a lot of sweet land. Um, gorgeous day, except for it's just windier than all it can be. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys go down, hit the like button if you like that big shed. Uh, hit the subscribe button if you're liking what you're seeing, and uh, comment. Uh, if you guys had any luck, finding sheds this year if so comment down below and uh thank you and always share have a good one we'll see you next time what it do five in the morning and i got my mind on loop i never sleep because they smoke up in the bugatti i woke up in the coop it's a g 35 gin and juice where i woke up feeling like snoop and the whole team ready about the action and we didn't come to loot. now we didn't come to loot. a certified polymath i am living proof and i just kick it i do my business and then i visit the obituary when i hit the booth and i did it all on my own because nobody showed me no love but now they say damn it he's grown you should have known now what is